Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another round of Let's Be a Giant Shark and Tear Shit Up. This mission is Blood on the Beach. Well, it's the 4th of July, folks. The dogs are hot. The burgers are burgin. Burgers are burgin. I wanted to say bacon, but it didn't quite work. But then they get bacon bakes. No, you don't bake bacon, you fry bacon. So the dogs are frying. Good to know. And anyways, it's the 4th of July here in Amity, and holy cow, is the turnout impressive. There's got to be dozens of people here. <laughs> the whole town's population, all nine of them. As well as the tourists, all nine trillion of them. Holy cow. This is Channel 6 News, reporting live to you from high above beautiful Amity, Maine. There's thousands of people down below, all gathered for the 4th of July celebration. The giant shark which has de devastated the economy and the people of this fine little town for weeks is now finally believed to be dead. And we can't think of any possible reason that he might survive except for that giant gray fin in the HOLY SHIT! So we're gonna be eating five folks before they can reach the beach. Nope, 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 nope. This is actually not so easy. Chomp. I accidentally uh, let that idiot go. Even though he's flying away, it doesn't really count unless you pretty much make absolutely sure that they've been eaten. Oh. Now there's dork number three. Dork number two. <laughs> Hi there, I'm eating you in front of your whole fucking family and all your friends. Oh, you thought you could get away from me, did you? That's adorable. Well, that's everybody. Now the checkpoint's been cleared, we'll have to find a way into the pod. Yeah, bet your ass! Stay out of the water! Oh my god, there's nobody left in the water because the shark ate everyone. Guess where? Whoa, and watch out because those... Those Coast Guard ships are armed, and they will fire at you. For so now we'll take the barrel in our mouth, and to get into the pod, which is protected by that electrical fence, you blow a hole in it with the explosive barrel, and head in. Now we have 50 seconds to destroy all the boats in the pod. Remember this banana boat from Jaws 4? Oh, it is so satisfying to see this thing wiped out. Destroy four more boats to complete the challenge. You don't have to do anything to the people in the boats, just take the boats down. Boat number three, down. This is the boat that's hardest to get because it's the fastest, and it's the toughest. This particular boat is also crewed by a guy with a gun. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> and now that is not. Two more boats. One more boat. Avast, the banana boat appears to be the last boat standing. Because it's actually a little tougher than you'd think it would be. Anyways. Peel the banana. Find the mayor's yacht in the harbor and shove it into one of the barges. Now. The pond and the harbor are not the same thing. Uh oh. And don't let yourself get hit by one of those things and try not to... Oh boy. Try not to run smack in the electrical net either, because that would not be good. In order to get... Eh, that's not what I meant. There we go. Now follow the bright red dot, and it will lead you... Oh, hello. More explosive barrels. We don't need those right now. Our sharky selves will do just fine. Fed for the red dot, that is the mayor's yacht. Remember how the mayor told everybody that he was going to be celebrating the festivities right out on, on the water along with everybody else? He wasn't lying. There he is now. Something's happening out of the pond, Mr. Mayor. We must leave. Things are getting... Oh, shit! Look at the size of that thing! Surprise, motherfucker! It is. It can. And you are shark food. So, the mayor's yacht doesn't get the bright idea to, you know, head back home every out after uh, it's damaged enough. So what you're going to want to do instead is chase it down. 
Now, I don't know who the heck is on the mayor's yacht. I'm guessing it's Bullseye, because whoever it is, they will hit you every time they shoot, and they will shoot a lot. What you're going to want to do more than anything else is to survive. Don't be afraid to head down to the sea floor and eat some fish. Or a tin can, whatever. And wait for that boat. The mayor's eat boat. Ugh, looks like I can't eat anybody up there. Wait for the mayor's yacht to get right around near where the fireworks barges are, and then ram it into the fireworks barge in order to do damage. This is the only way to do lasting damage to the mayor's boat. So don't even try any other way. But you're gonna want to be very fast about it, and uh, if you don't move your ass off, then you're gonna be in big trouble because it's really easy to die in this stage because of that guy on the mayor's boat. Some of the folks on the uh, fireworks boats will start shooting at you as well, but none of them are as aggravating as the mayor's. Now, fortunately, the mayor's boat will tend to hang right around the fireworks boats, so don't be afraid to hang around them as well. As soon as the mayor's boat gets close enough, just slam it into the fireworks boat with all your might. And keep in mind that it will hang or deliberately hang around the fireworks boats, so you can line up your attacks like this! See what just happened? You knock it in. The oh, crap. Don't be afraid, by the way, to uh, upgrade your strength stats, because they will be proven valuable in improving your ramming abilities and thus helping the mayor's boat get slammed into the other boat. Another way to do it is to deliberately aim a little high so that when the mayor's boat tips, it, uh... Sla strikes the fireworks boat because simply ramming it from the bottom doesn't move it enough to really do the damage that you need to do. Happy hell of a 4th of July, everybody. Actually, it's the 4th of August as I uh, do this, but it was July when I started this playthrough, so uh, yay. It was actually initially going to be a Shark Week special, but I got a little behind in recording. Wait for it, wait for it. Oh, darn it. Just a little bit more. Come on, Mr. Mayor. Come over to the fireworks boat. We'll sure you'll get a 4th of July that you will never forget for as long as you live. For whatever that's worth. Boom! <laughs> that did the trick. By the way, Klug. Now the mayor's yacht's on fire. The fireworks ship is on fire. All the fireworks are going completely haywire because nobody got the chance or the time to separate them in, in advance. They're lighting each other on fire. Have a hellish 4th of July, everybody! <laughs> That's how sharks laugh. Yep. It lived all right. Oh, no shit. I got something for him. You coming, Brody? I have electronic tracking equipment we can use. I'll get my supplies and catch up with you. Well, that was a hellish 4th of July. See you next time, farewell.